you some facts, but to teach you some reality. I'm about to teach you some reality. But now it's time. You need to stop believing in these alternative facts, these divine false or Christopher Columbus was a devil rapist killing pillaging natives. You need to know your facts. Stop believing in these alternative facts. These, these divine foster. Christopher Columbus was an evil, raping, killing, pillaging natives. Back again with the ideological lies. You see, fear and death. Love was to pay the priest. Patrons and wealth, aka welfare. Patron, prepare to see the worst in humankind. Prepare to see, prepare to get away with murder, raping, terrorism. Fuck your Cuckoo ideas. You're building. Uh, your buildings are whores that sleep with the nation. Find it out your whole life is a nightmare. You have the most of the humans are monsters. They are the ones you keep fighting on an anxiety filled world where people get sick and pe for peace sakes get some help in this sick world. Yes. Oh, divine prophets. Divine Prophets! Back again with the ideological using fear and loved ones to make everybody have to pay their patrons and welfare. Prepare to see the worst in humankind that you'll never get to see. Revelations ends is the end of the world. Be prepared for the worst. Humans getting worse. People getting away with murder, rape, terrorism. Fuck your cuckhole ideas. Simps of the Babylon. Your buildings are whores that sleep with a nation. Find out that the world you live in is your nightmare. Most humans are your are the monsters that we are fighting in society. The world. Here we go. Divine prophets telling lies. But put but put faith in God and not faith in man-made structures. Not man-made structures. Divine prophets telling us lies. Put faith in God, not in the man made structures. Because when the last days will come, you'll be judged for your evil sin. Yeah. Divine prophets tell lies. Put faith in God, not faith in man made structures. Cause when the last days come, you'll be judged for your evil. Back at again with the ideological lies. Using fears of the loved ones that pay the priests, pay John's welfare, get ready to see the worst in people. Christopher Columbus was a devil rapist killing pillaging natives. Stop believing in the alternative facts. This is reality that we live in. This is what we, this is what we came from. This is exactly what, what, you know, what's not in your textbooks. This is exactly what's not in your textbooks. The alternative facts that keeps getting twisted around just, just to keep brainwashing you and keep you stupid. That's why we get oversensitive over every kind of protest because we're exposing the truth for what it is. And you know, now, you know, and now that you see the world, this is the true world we live in. Everything is hidden for a reason because if people came out with their shady agenda, it would be exposed. Don't believe in the alternative facts that people tell you. Don't believe in our textbooks. You must believe the facts that come out. Divine prophets telling us lies. Put faith in God, not faith in man made structures. Cause when the last day comes, you'll be judged for your evil. Don't you know? Divine prophets tell us lies. But put faith in God, not faith in man made structures. Cause when the last days come, you'll be judged for your evil sin. Divine prophets telling us lies. Put faith in God, not faith in man made structures. Cause when the last day comes, you'll be judged for your evil.
Divine prophets tell us lies. Put faith in God, not faith in man-made structures. When the last and when the last day comes, you'll be judged for your evil. Yeah, yeah. Don't believe these alternate facts. They're the worlds that brain got you brainwashed and cuckold. Using the textbooks to lie, to tell lies, to manipulate the truth. You can't even see. We live in this chapter black. Chapter black is about the truth of the world that we live in. The reality. The reason why they don't want you to protest, the reason why they don't want you to address an issue on social media or reblog stuff. If you get hate for it, it's because you're raised awareness, awareness to the truth that everybody's trying to hide. This country was made with the bloods of millions of thousands. Even the state of Kansas is called blood, uh, Bleeding Kansas for a reason. Because Bleeding Kansas is pretty much a spot where we killed natives. In the name of patriotism, in the name of anything, we all been lied to and manipulated. Just try to understand this. Everything that you stood for is only half truths. Now, no disrespect or anything like this, but you need to really think about why are people go going out of their way to hide something? Why are they trying to shut you up? Shut your argument up. Why are they trying to use political correctness to make sure you don't bring up the subject that makes them feel uncomfortable? Because they don't want to hear the truth. Because the truth is making people feel uncomfortable. You know. This is chapter black number one. Divine falsehoods. Reshape your thinking.